Hey, what's up? Uh, you're live on the Dodo's Facebook. Um, I'm Laszlo. Today we're going to be making um, peanut butter oat pumpkin dog treats with my doggy, Polly. Um, she's really psyched. She's already eating some peanut butter in her con. So let's do this. Okay, to start off, we're going to get one cup pumpkin puree. And that's, uh, make sure you're using 100% pure pumpkin, not pumpkin pie mix, because it has sugar and spices in it. And your dog should probably not be eating that. Where'd you get your dog from, Lasso? Um, she is a rescue from Sea Spot Rescue. They're based in Jersey City, New Jersey, and Manhattan. Check them out. We've had her since. What was that? We've had her since <laughs> September. Um, yeah, um, it took us a while. To decide to get another dog after our last dog passed away in the summer but um we decided something was missing so we were following a bunch of shelters on instagram and facebook and um we saw polly and we we're like that dog looks awesome um i don't know maybe it was her little short little legs Sierra Heitzman's actually calling her literally a pit bull with tiny legs. <laughs> literally a pit bull with tiny legs. Yeah, that is what's happening there. Um, so, we got a cup of pumpkin puree and a quarter cup of peanut butter. Should always go with natural peanut butter, not like, you know, the brands with uh, sugar or hydrogenated oil. Just like just peanuts or peanuts and salt, like that at the most, just peanuts and salt. But that's it. Um, Our Keita McKinney wants to know how old she is. She is a little over one. I mean, as far as we know, she's full grown now. So because this is the natural peanut butter, I'm going to get chunky, but that's okay. Actually, it might work a little better with creamy, but <laughs> it'll work. She'll still love it. This is, because it's natural, we have to mix in the oil. But we got time. Right, Polly? Right? Just chilling. Quarter cup of peanut butter. What's up, y'all? Any questions from the peanut butter gallery? <laughs> Bashar Nana wants to know what you're trying to do. I am making natural homemade dog treats for my dog Polly. With pumpkin, peanut butter, and oats. How does that sound? Can I eat it? Yes, you can. Great. You can share your dog treats with your, or whatever. You guys can share the treats. If you like peanut butter, oats, and pumpkin. I think Polly's ready. She's like ready right now. For your sight. Can you smell <laughs> that peanut butter? Yeah, she can. There's only one cup. Oh, it's already there. Hey, Polly. 
Say hi to the dodo. Roger McLean wants to know what breed she is. She is a... Okay, we think she's a pit corgi mix. Specifically of the bully breeds, we think she, she's a Staffordshire Terrier. Does this all guesses? She's a, she's a rescue, she's a mutt, and that's okay. Um, so, alright, let's get started. Um, okay, so we're going to go with... Oh. Oh, Polly. Good stretch. So, Polly, her mother's last name is Silk. Um, so, we named her Polly Esther Silk. Get it? Uh, <laughs> she, uh, you can follow her on Instagram, Polly Esther Silk. Do it. Um, so, first off, we have. Um, no, not oats. My bad. We're gonna do the pumpkin for pumpkin. We're gonna do all the liquid stuff first. Oh, get Polly. She's like, oh, what's that? Polly, do that again. That was awesome. Did you want to see what this was? Nah, she was standing up. It was really cute. She'll probably do it again. <laughs> she actually did it when we met her. When we went to go meet her the first time, she stood up and looked at a bone that was on top of the desk. And we were like, that's awesome! So, there's one cup of um, pumpkin puree. Um, a quarter cup of peanut butter. Natural peanut butter. And 100% pumpkin puree. Not pumpkin pie mix. Don't do it. Bad, bad idea. And then we're going to do a quarter cup of water. You can also use milk, but to make this vegan friendly, we're going to use water. Um, there's some debates on the internet about whether, do you, whether soy and almond is good for animals. I don't know. I'm sure a little bit doesn't hurt, but you know, I'm not an expert. Polly wouldn't mind. Hey buddy. Just hang out there. Stay, stay. <laughs> so, uh, no. Okay, we're gonna beat this with a electric mixer. Uh -huh. ah. Is it? Is it? <laughs> Are you getting pumpkin puree on your Hello. All right, so there's that. And then uh, I'm going to add the oats. Make a little mess. Is that right? Whoa. Just making more of a mess. All right, gradually add this... Uh, not all of there's it says three cups total you're going to just add two and a half for the mix and then later for a half a cup we're going to use that to coat um the oats so i'm going to start mixing this in in the meantime it's just regular old-fashioned oats this is getting crazy get in there let me get some more uh, Terry Sanders Martin wants you to repeat the ingredients and ratios you're using. Will do. Okay, one cup of pumpkin puree. Um, quarter cup of peanut, natural peanut butter. Uh, quarter cup of water or milk, whatever you feel comfortable with. Um, and then a total of three cups of oats, but the two and a half is going in in the treat, uh, in the first, in the mix with all this pumpkin stuff and all that stuff, all the liquid stuff, and then at the end we're going to roll it in some extra oats, a half a cup of oats, but three cups of oats total. hope that makes sense. 
so half a cup more. I love some bunny cut shots as men are so messy in the kitchen. I'm sorry, I spilled I spilled <laughs> the oats. You're right, you're right. My girlfriend agrees. I've been making sourdough bread a lot lately. And oh Jesus, this is getting crazy. I don't I don't I'm not really feeling this mixer. I don't know why the recipe says to use a mixer. Forget the mixer, I'm using the spatula. Because now I'm feeling self-conscious. Okay. So there is Okay, so there is that. Um, now we are going to take this last half cup of oats. <laughs> You're spilling everywhere. I'm trying to hurry. We're running out of time, guys. And then take this little ice cream scoop, cookie, cookie scoop. And then um, we're going to roll them in oats, or whatever you want to call this. I'm going to call it rolling. And then you put them over on a little plate. And once we're done with those, we're going to put these in the freezer for an hour and uh, then you're going to give them to your cute little dog or big dog or medium sized dog. Holly's found a few scraps so far. Thank you so Doing much. a good job. Good vacuum cleaner. She's really good at that. When I didn't have a dog for a few months, life really sucked. But we have a dog now. It's awesome. Because who likes to clean floors? I promise I'll clean this all up. <laughs> awesome. All right, and we'll be back live in an hour for Polly to eat the treats. Peace! Peace. Bye.